Good morning, Capricorns. This video will be for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. And love. Hey, Capricorns. Let's see what's going on with you guys right now. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for liking and subscribing. Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. And love. Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. And love. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, please give me for me. Messages for Capricorn. Okay, you guys. Capricorn. So, I love this what we got here for Capricorns. Mm hmm. left out in the cold. Five of Pentacles is at the bottom of the deck. Okay, so Capricorns, you're feeling left out in cold in love. Okay, maybe a cycle has ended with the Empress. Okay, uh, due to some type of truthful communication, somebody, some truths, somebody spoke some truths, or they felt like you were speaking your truths, and they ended something. Yep, they felt like, you know, they decided, they decided to be with someone that was more forthcoming towards them. Maybe Capricorn, you pulled away from this person at a certain point. And this person said, you know what? I'm not telling them. They said, I'm not playing this game with you, Capricorn. Okay? Period. So, present energy for Capricorn right now. Or you said that to them. Shit. Right. Present energy is uh, the hangman. So, yeah. There will be a delay in the situation for sure. Yep. Due to a third party. Okay? Maybe a delay with reconciling with someone else. Because somebody is emotionally unavailable towards you. They are wanting the Ten of Cups, okay? Happiness, okay? There's a delay because somebody is emotionally unavailable. Okay, what is hidden from you, Capricorns? The Ten of Wands. You could be hiding that this is uh, that you have a lot of burdens, or there is uh, something that's heavy, that's weighing heavy on you, okay? Right. Maybe taking a leap of faith towards something, someone victorious, because you. There's a need. You have a lover here, other lover. There's a need for this person maybe to cut one person out, walk away, you know. But I'm feeling like uh, Capricorn, something happened, and you're just under a lot of stress. You have a lot of burdens right now, okay? Let's see what your obstacles is. Obstacles for Capricorn. Yeah. Money coming slow. Things stop moving, you know, towards you, Capricorn. Things are not going to be moving here. Um, there's a need for you to stay in your ground, maybe, towards slow-moving things, okay? There could be somebody that is very defensive, or you're having to defend yourself because something was one-sided here, and that's why the tower hit. Now you have having regrets for being one-sided, okay? And that was you, because the double card was right there. Maybe something was toxic as well. What is the outcome here for Capricorn? The outcome. Ten of Pentacles. So that's a pretty good outcome, okay? Being stable, getting your money, you know, getting your money up. Things come looking good, you know. Uh, security is the outcome with the Ten of Pentacles. But we're going to check. We're going to uh, we're gonna go ahead on and see what's going on with that, okay? Right. The Ten of Pentacles. We're going to clarify all of this, okay? Yeah, you went in hermit mode, or someone else did. I'm feeling a lot of pushback here. Like, somebody is fighting this connection, or you were fighting the connection. But I feel like it's a back and forth thing. Whoever this with this person, okay?
I feel like you're going to stay single and wait for something else. All right. You have the Knight of Wands wanting to move in passionately towards starting a brand new passionate creative endeavor that you want to be secure in. But they're telling you to use your intuition because something is toxic here. This person is needing to cut out something or you're needing to make a decision about someone. Okay? Okay. The hanging in here, fighting in for Capricorn. Wow, tower. Yeah, something's going to blow this bullshit right out of the water. Whatever that was stagnant, okay, people, somebody wasn't making decisions or whatever. It's going to get blown up, okay? Three of swords is at the bottom of the deck. So this situation is going to get blown up and real love is going to come in pretty fast. There will be an equal give and take here once the cycle ends. Okay, tower. Terrify the tower for Capricorn. Yeah, with this number of a lover, whatever, Gemini, okay? It could be the other one of Gemini that you were trying to have something brand new with, offering them a cup of love, okay? Um, but I'm feeling like um, there it will be a stagnant, whatever was that was stagnant is about to get blown up, okay? And maybe a new lover is coming in, the lover is terrified of the lover. Feeling left out in the cold, yeah. So somebody's going to... Yeah, somebody's going to get the offer from a King of Pentacles. Hmm. Let's see what the Five of Pentacles is here for. You're feeling left out in the cold because you don't have a lover. Maybe this person moved away or is moving away from you to be happy. Because they cut you out. They felt like you were toxic. They started using their intuition. You know, realizing that you weren't offering the Ten of Pentacles. You were more so giving them the three. Now, this could, like I said, sw switch it around. Okay, you guys. So, this could be what they were doing to you. But somebody had another lover here. This is why they left you on the cold. And they're moving away towards this other lover. Oh, interesting. Ten of Wands. So, hidden from you. Love. Okay. <clears throat> Could be a water sign. Piece of cup. An offer. Yeah, maybe somebody wants to work together with you here, yeah, or you want to work on love. You're trying to manifest this in your life. Okay, this person is making a decision. You're making a decision about this Queen of Swords. Okay. They are your wish fulfillment. You want to move away with them or towards them. Okay. Um, but I'm feeling like whoever it is uh, you want to work on love with, this person here, may be manipulative or you are manipulating them. Let's see what the Eight of Pentacles is. Eight of Pentacles is for Capricorn. Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, somebody has you in the third party. This is what's hitting. They're working on something with someone else. Three of Pentacles. I mean, three of Cups. Yeah. This uh, person is definitely trying to make a decision now. That's why it's a delay. That's why this person is pulling away from you. Because they may be starting a brand new passion to creative endeavor with a uh, fire sign um, that is more stable. Then you, vice versa, you know, take the messages as they go. The Knight of Pentacles, the Knight of Pentacles. The Ten of Wands, so obstacles for you to get over. Okay, so if this was someone that you already were in a relationship with, um, because I see you have two tens here, then they both are Ten of Wands, three tens actually. Um, ten of wands, okay. Something is burdening you that somebody needs to stop moving towards you, and this is an obstacle for you, okay. The ten of wands, the ten of wands. all right. You want to make this person a real offer, okay. Getting an offer from this person is a thing, okay. 
judgment is about to be called on that situation. If this is a home, somebody like it's you're feeling burdened in a home with someone. Because there's a lot of holding back love and affection and emotion and stuff like that. That's why you want to make an offer to someone else so bad. Page of Pentacles. Page of Pentacles. Yeah. Seven of Wands. It's a lot of this push pushback. Like somebody's like very like, I don't want this. Okay. Could be dealing with a fire sign. But this is an obstacle. Because something is burdening you, absolutely. And it's to make this offer towards this person that's very defensive. This person is very defensive towards you. You know, your need to make a decision to manifest something and throw your guard up. You know, and keep your options open. Or that's what this person is doing. Seven of wands. Seven of wands. Because you, you feel like you got to defend yourself here. Justice. Getting justice is what you want. With this type of energy. Um, that sucks. So, you could be dealing with a Libra, but at the same time, this person is very defensive towards you. Or you're needing to defend yourself in a court system, I'm hearing. Um, they're probably going to give you the minimum. Sentence here. If this is somebody that has a problem in the justice system... There's a, you're defending yourself here. Mm. Page of Pentacles is uh, awful. Then got the Ten of Wands. Well, whatever they say, it's still heavy maybe you had to pay something to something and something you had to pay some money out to justices like maybe this is like could be something small like tickets or something like that but it's heavy on you you know it's money that you had to give away you ain't even have it to, you ain't have it to give okay that's what happened mm. Let's see what the Ten of Pentacles is. Can I find the Ten of Pentacles? Sure. Ten of Pentacles. Where are the Ten of Pentacles? Yeah. The Four of Wands in the reverse. Judgment is about to be called on that. King of Pentacles in the reverse. And Judgment. Okay, judgment will be called on a home situation. If you were living with somebody in a home or whatever your whatever your security was, judgment was going to be called on it because there was no leadership in it. You didn't use your intuition by working together with someone so that you could be stable and have this passionate, creative endeavor. Okay, the king of pentacles in the reverse. King of pentacles in the reverse. Right. It was a non-committal type of energy offering thing. Somebody realized, either you told somebody that you weren't in a situation, Capricorn, or you weren't married, whatever, but they found out somehow by your actions. Your actions to gave you away how you were acting. You were non-committal. You didn't want to, you know, let's see what this Knight of Cups is. Because I'm curious now. <laughs> Knight of Cups. What is this Knight of Cups? This Queen of Cups. Right. There was a Queen of Cups here. <laughs> Somebody went spying and seen that you had a queen of cups. I, listen, they think that you were married. Somebody think that you were married because of the way you were acting. The universe exposed this to them. If this is you or somebody you are currently dealing with. Okay. Or we're dealing with. Yep. Codependency. There's a lot of codependency here. Oh. In an unrequited love situation. Maybe you were acting like you were the King of Pentacles, but you weren't. Somebody is pretending to be abundant, but they're not. It's like putting on a bad show. <laughs> because this person went looking, seeking for the truth, and they found it. So the jig is up, Capricorns. <laughs> right, whatever the situation is. We have a lot of baggage, okay? So if they're, you're trying to make offers, 
this is why people are fighting off because it's like the universe like take care of what you got to take care of first because you know mm -mm. okay Capricorn, you have messages. Yes, you do. You have two messages. Wedding, huh? The situation involves marriage. It's at the bottom of the deck. Healing family issues. Maybe somebody got married on you. Wow, that's crazy. Release your ex in reconciliation. Ha <laughs> ha. So release your ex. The time, the, uh, the time has come to clear your energy. Okay, Capricorns, releasing this ex that may be married now is a very important thing. And someone from your past is returning. Maybe this person, this ex, has returned. The one, this is who this is about. The one that's married. This person could be married now, though. Playfulness, because you deserve love. Calling in your soulmate. You got a new love that came in. This could be the one. But, um, yeah. So, Capricorn, I hope this helps. <laughs> I know it seemed like, I felt like it was all over the place. But, I hope this helped you guys. Um... Make sure you like, subscribe, and share to my share uh, my videos and subscribe to my channel. And I will talk to you guys later.